All right, everyone, don't panic. But I have some heartbreaking news to share with you. Sonic is dead. That's right. I'm sorry that I have to tell you, but Sega killed Sonic. And it is up to us to figure out who did it. That is the main premise of this detective slash mystery visual novel that was released today. As what I can only assume is Sega's attempt at an April Fool's release. Which is funny considering that this is the best Sonic game we've gotten since Sonic Mania. So you tell me what the real joke is. Anyways, this, this is such a bizarre release that I did not expect at all. I mean, no one did. How could we? Who would have ever thought that an Ace Attorney style game with Sonic characters would ever come out and be canon no less? Or, okay. Well, at least it's official. If you've been following the Sonic community for any sort of time, you know that these flash visual novel games have always existed. The Sonic community is no stranger to these visual novel style games. There's been countless of flash fan-made games that follow this concept. Some involving Sonic inflating his friends or something like that, but, but now we have the real deal. A Sega developed Sonic visual novel. And considering it's a joke release of sorts, hey, it's pretty fun. I love visual novels, and mystery visual novels are my jam, so believe me when I say this is not the most thrilling, twisty, gut-wrenching story, not that anyone was expecting it, but here you will find some incredibly charming art, cute character in interactions, and best of all, you get to see Blaze, oh how I've missed you Blaze, oh my god Blaze, but besides that, seeing everyone in their party outfits is pretty neat and it this seems like a very sad fan servicey game you know just showing all the sonic characters the story is cute it's mostly just like haha amy said funny thing haha look at look at knuckles in the cowboy hat like it's not a very deep game by any means but you know what it's it's here and it's pretty cool the storyline is very simple you're a brand new employee at some prestigious railroad company that hosts events and banquets and stuff like that and none other than Amy herself has decided to host her birthday party here. But not just any birthday party, no, 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 no. A murder mystery party. And the cast of this game features some of the most beloved Sonic characters, all dressed up in party attire. They each play a role in this murder mystery that Amy has planned. Yes, even Shadow was willing to participate. Look at him in his cute little green hat. Your role in this game is initially to just be an employee. Make sure to serve food and tend to the passengers, but... Something mysterious happens on this train, and you end up becoming a bit of an ace detective, helping Tails and Amy figure things out. Not everything is as it seems in this mystery train, and when you find a collapsed Sonic, you have to ask yourself, is he really dead, or is this just part of the party? That is for you to find out in this gem of an April Fool's joke. The murder of Sonic the Hedgehog is available for free on Steam, so go download it for yourself. With that being said, happy April Fool's everyone, and take care.